Paintex from Cormelt lets you paint on your video and instantly track it to the motion. This short tutorial will explain how you can output the alpha of the strokes you paint in various ways. I'll show you a simple example. I'll add the masked track paint to this clip, open the editor, draw a simple stroke along here, and then exit the paint editor. So what you'll see is I have three drop-down menus here. One of them controls where we're taking the color that we see from. It can be from the strokes and background, which is the default. You can see the color only, or the BG only. And then similarly, we have the alpha can be from the strokes over the background or the strokes only. And then lastly, we tell Paintex how you want to see the alpha. So for example, the default is to include the alpha in the clip, which means if you copy that over another clip, you'll see it composite correctly uh, according using Final Cut Pro's built-in blend modes. However, if you're doing some kind of processing with another plugin, you might want to output the luma of the stroke instead to use that as a mask. That is the basic idea. You can also access the inverse luma. And then there's some other options which make sense if you're painting on something which has alpha already. Here's an example. We have this clip that has a alpha mask over the clouds. To demonstrate better, I'm just going to turn the background off, apply mask track paint, open the editor. Now, just to show you how this works, I'm going to do some big soft strokes across the entire thing. Let's just change that, give us a red, and give us a green. So I can start here and go, there we go. Exit that. Okay, so the default is as we used to before. You can see that it is preserving the transparency below if I turn back on the clouds. And what I can then do is combine the alpha of the city background and the paint strokes in various ways. So for example, I can say I want to see the alpha as the intersection of both of those, or as the uh, exclusion, which basically means one or the other, but not both. And obviously, if you're outputting it as a, as a luma mat, you can also have the same options. That's the introduction to the tracked paint mask outputs. And let us know if you have any questions. Feel free to send us an email at any time. Thank you.